everyone. So as I mentioned in my previous video that I made my own maternity jeans, I just wanted to share that with you guys because I know how stressful it is to look for new maternity jeans. I mean, trust me, I've done it in the past and you're never going to find a nice fitting maternity jeans like under 50 bucks it's ridiculous all the jeans that i saw that were really cute were like 60 70 bucks and more expensive um i tried a lot of maternity places online and they're very expensive um and of course you know you want to be in fashion too because you're pregnant doesn't mean you can't dress in fashion and i have gotten used to the skinny jeans so i really want maternity skinny jeans which I found a few, but like I said, they're like $60, $70, so it's pretty pretty ridiculous to pay that much for a jean that you're only going to wear for six months. Um, so I found a way to do, make my own maternity jeans, and I have a video that I previously recorded of me making some skinny jeans. And I'm just going to show you, for example, I mean some skinny jeans, some maternity jeans. I'm just going to show you an example of these jeans right here. I don't know. Let me just turn the light on. Okay. So I made these jeans, these were some distressed jeans that I had before I was pregnant and this is what they look like, and you guys can see, and um, they're just torn, and they're not skinny jeans, they're boot cut, but they're pretty small from the bottom, I still like them, this is what they look like from the back, and all I did was I cut the panel all around, and then um, I cut where the button goes like this I cut all where the button goes I explained this in my I explained this in the video that I'm just you're gonna watch right now but I'm just gonna show you in person like in me showing it to you and then you can use any type of shirts this was just a regular little tube top that I had that I never even used this is this one and I just sewed it on so then this is the panel and it goes all the way up to my belly all the way under my boobs and then I can actually fold it down also like this to have like that layering effect like if I'm wearing another little shirt under especially right now that I'm not so big in my stomach you know I don't want to wear the panel all the way up to my stomach so I fold it down like this and then I just put my shirt over it and it looks really cute and you can't even tell like that I made them they look like they're real maternity jeans and I showed my boyfriend and he, he thought it was pretty cool um you can use like these kind of shirts to make the panel you just cut off here or you can use like the spaghetti strap shirts and stuff like that let me just show you these have the, the panel in the back I didn't cut it but I did cut the front and then this is what it looks like just from the front and then let's see what else these are these were regular maternity jeans that I bought from um, Didi's discount. It's like a it's like a Ross, kind of the same as a Ross, only different name. So I bought these when I found that I was first pregnant, because so they were like nine ninety nine, and these are from Mommy Maternity Jeans, and these were a size small, but they were like bell bottom like real big from the bottom they have this um thick panel which is pretty thick which i really don't like and um they're really big and like if i put them on it looks like if i have a it looks like if i have a penis or something <laughs> they're not really form fitting and then i there was more that make your butt look really saggy so i really didn't like that either so all i all i did was i sewed them i i put a regular jean skinny jean of mine over it and i traced it with a pin and I cut it off and I sewed it and I made them into um, my own little skinny jeans so that's pretty cool too if you don't want to go through all the sewing around here and stuff you can do that and I also use this to to cut the shape of the jeans how it's supposed to be um, watch my video and hopefully you guys can learn how to make your own maternity jeans instead of spending so much money in buying them all right so thanks so much bye so this is what you're gonna need you're gonna need some jeans that fit you before you're pregnant i'm just gonna be using these gray jeans from i think it's wet seal um and they fit me pretty good before i got pregnant 
And what you're going to do, let me just try to do this with one hand because it's pretty hard. Um, these I already sold them and I unstitched it because I just didn't like how it looked. But all you're going to do is you're going to cut straight across the back like this. As you see here. And when you do this, it's going to look a lot cleaner because like I said, I just unstitched mine again. Um, straight across and then when you get here you're gonna round it and you're gonna cut the whole panel that's right here kind of down to the button and you're gonna want to cut the zipper also because it's really bulky and if you try to sew it the machine is gonna get stuck or whatever but you're gonna want to cut the zipper off and you're gonna want to cut all around and you're gonna want to go up like this what I prefer to use are these kind of shirts the little tank shirts and you could find these any store some you can even find some for a dollar um i had a few that i never used so i used a few of those and this one i bought it at those suzy's deals or five dollar stores um that you have around your neighborhood i'm pretty sure they're everywhere and this one is a black one and all you're gonna do is cut like kind of from where your boobs go oh, and then it depends it depends also on how long the shirt is so it says this one is pretty long I'm gonna cut like from the where the boobs are where the boobs go just straight across like that and then that's what you're gonna sew onto the pants whatever you have left over here so I'm just gonna cut this across and then I'm gonna show you okay so as you can see I cut straight across tonight not all I have is like this kind of tube top looking thing like this see straight across and what you're gonna do now is you're gonna put it over your jeans and whatever side you want to go up to your belly it has to be facing down like for example I want the you can't really see because it's really dark but I want the bottom of the shirt to be on my over my belly and what I cut, I'm going to sew on to the jeans like this, all across. So what you're going to do for that is, I'm going to show you. Okay, so as you can see here, I turned the shirt, well you can't see, but I turned the shirt inside out so that all the stitching and stuff could be um, on the inside. But as you can see, all the stitching and stuff is, just turn the shirt inside out and pull it over your jeans like this. And you're going to have what the part that you cut, you're going to have it right here. And you're going to want to put it right to the edge of the jeans and you're going to sew all around, all around. Okay guys, so here are the jeans and they're already done. And I already sewed the, the shirt on here. And you can see it's nice and sewed. Let me show you the back. It's nice and sewed all around. And I'm going to try them on and show you guys how they look. Alright, so here it is. Hey, what's up girls? So this video is to show you the jeans. Um, so how my jeans look. The ones that I made that I said they're maternity. I'm in my bathroom right now and it's a bit dirty so don't mind that. Um, so this is the sweater that I was telling you guys that I bought at the, for $5 at the $5 store. Let me just take it off so you guys can see the, the jeans a lot better. Okay, so here are the jeans. Let me see if I can show them to you girls. Good here. Uh, they're just regular gray skinny jeans from Wet Seal. This is what they look like in the back. And the front and the sides. And there's the belly right there. Um, so I'm just going to show you. So before anything you girls don't mind the big belly and don't mind the stretch marks because you girls know I have two other kids so I have really bad stretch marks so oh, anyway um, so this is how I'm wearing it right now this is a shirt another shirt that I told you girls that I bought the fellow star and they're not maternity they're just regular like thermals only a lot thinner and very stretchy and of course with every shirt every one of my shirts I wear a little tank top like this one underneath so here it goes. So I'm gonna lift up the shirt so I can find it. Like this. And this is how it looks. 
with the panel folded I have actually folded it twice so I can actually fold it up like this let me just show you have it like this if it's more comfortable for you there's a front and there's a back or if you want once your belly gets a lot bigger let me just put my shirt up you can put the put this higher up like this see so yeah so yeah they fit me really comfortable so it looks like but yeah that's about it girls i hope you guys try this and i hope um you guys like it and i hope if you do make your own maternity jeans post it down here so that i can see what you guys did all right thanks girls bye